Eric with Crew Chiropractic and I'm with Sarah from Body by Design and we're going to be demonstrating some core stability exercises today. The purpose of core stability exercises is to protect the spine so as you're exercising or just going about your activities of daily living you have less pressure in your low back and the rest of your body. Okay, the first exercise we're going to do today is single leg hip extension. So what you'll do is lay flat on the ground with your back, feet flat on the ground. You extend one leg so it matches the angle of your other leg. Okay, and now you'll slowly extend your hips up into the air and back down. And if you want to make it more challenging, you can get a small band and place it between the knees so you have that pressure that you have to fight to keep your hips in proper alignment. This just makes it one step more difficult. You'll do three sets of 10 each side. All right, the next exercise we're gonna do is single leg RDLs. And with this, the two cues, go ahead and get started here, Sarah. The two cues are to keep the spine very neutral and flat as you bend over. So good, go ahead and do a rep. Good, so notice she's opposite foot, opposite hand as she bends over. As you do the rep, you wanna try and avoid your toe coming out. Keep your toe stacked as you go forward. Excellent. So the next exercise we're gonna do are bird dogs. So if you wanna get started with them, Sarah. This exercise, what you will do is extend the opposite arm and opposite foot. And the goal of this exercise is to train the upper back muscles and the glutes to help undo poor posture and create more st spinal stability. Do I? I'm just kidding, we're doing dead bugs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so dead bugs, what you do is bring your legs into a 90-90 position. This one's pretty complicated on the brain. What you will do is extend, extend your right arm for me and your left leg at the same time. Okay, you'll bring them back together, opposite. If this gets too complicated or too difficult, you can just do arms or legs by themselves at, uh, one at a time. The most important cue is the space underneath the back right here should stay flush with the floor. If you start getting that arch position, don't extend your legs out as far. Maybe max out here instead of going to a full extension. Watch out. Okay. All right, so the next exercise we're gonna do is a modified farmer's carry. So what you will do is just lift up whatever, uh, whatever object you have handy. It could be a dumbbell, kettlebell, water jug, laundry detergent, a kit. And what you will do is brace your stomach so you're not bending off to the side. And as you do this, you can either do intentional, you can do exercises where you go off to the side like Sarah's demonstrating, so demonstrate. So go to the right, back up to neutral. To the left, back up to neutral. So with this imbalance, you're creating more core stability, having your spine straighten out. The other exercise you can do is you can just walk around the house or walk down your driveway with a weight. So demonstrate walking down uh, the big grass here. Excellent. And what you want to avoid is slouch off to your right. That. You don't want that to happen. Excellent. 